Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Hope you guys are all doing well on this little trip up to Ludington. We thought we'd sit down and it's November. Christmas is right around the corner. Mm -hmm. So we would thought we would talk about the top 10 things for the camper in your life. So all the items we talk about today will be um, connected with our Amazon affiliate store. The link to that store is in the description below. Perfect. Let's get started. All right. Number, Number one. one. So the first thing are the felt baskets that we use in our camper. So we use them in our little cubbies in the front. They fit perfectly so that they don't move around at all. And they hold lots of the just little things that you need a spot to contain them. They come in teal, navy, and charcoal. So you can find the color that fits for your decor. Perfect. Number, Number two. two. A little step stool. I use this thing for everything. Yes, you do. <laughs> so I can get into the um, into our fridge that's sitting in the back of the tr truck. I just am not quite tall enough to reach the bottom of it. So that step stool helps me get in there. And then also as a little footstool. Whenever I'm sitting somewhere, I always need a footstool. And these little bitty step stools that fold up nice and flat are perfect for my footstool. Perfect. Number, Number three, three is the candle lantern. I absolutely love my candle lantern. It's actually made by UCO, but uh, I got mine so long ago. Eastern Mountain Sports was around, and that was probably 15 years ago. Still use it, take it on every trip. Gives nice ambient light. It puts out a little bit of heat. Um, it's just a nice soft glow. We use it on our picnic table. We put it around the campfire. You don't want a whole lot of light, but you want enough to see the marshmallows and be able to get them over the fire. So, And when it's too hot, that becomes our campfire. Yes, we have had <laughs> where it's 95 degrees and it's way too hot. We just take the candelier, light it up, and put it in the center of the fire ring and set it around the candlelight. It gives a nice ambience glow, kind of dances around, and we're not burning firewood. We're not getting too hot. Yep. Number right. four. four. Quick dry towels. Um, we started with just a small little one for in our kitchen and found out that it dries really quickly after we get done doing dishes. We moved up to a size to use for our showers and we now have actually even gotten them for using at the beach. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't take up so much room in our small trailer because as you know, small camping, you need small gear and they dry so quick. Correct. Number, Number five. five. Number five is a table. It's a side table made by GCI. It's portable, lightweight, made out of aluminum, has a plastic top on it that's kind of graded and it's got slots. This thing folds up really quick and easy. Uh, it folds open quick. We use it by the side of our side table when we're trying to cook and prep meals. We move it out by the campfire. We use it for putting food and drinks and beverages in the candelier. Um, it's just a great accessory table. It's lightweight. It doesn't matter if it sits out in the rain, uh, being that's aluminum and plastic construction. Uh, we have got the bigger one in order. That's a 25 inch. This this one that we currently have is a little bit smaller. I want to say it's in the 18, 20 inch range, and it'll be linked down below. Number, Number six. six. So this one is the red levelers. Um, how many times have you tried to get your trailer level with one board? Not quite enough, so you have to back up and you put two boards, and it just is takes time and it's very cons time consuming to get to the level state. So with these red levelers, you just start rolling on it and it gets thicker and thicker. I just stand in the middle of the truck in the trailer and see when it's level and say stop and we're done. It's so much quick, so much quicker and easier so than it used to be. And easier. That's right. <laughs> so I uh, love them. Let's see, number seven. Flip the notes, number seven. Is a Camp Chef Everest stove. We've had the Coleman stove for years and years, and my biggest gripe was that I could never simmer, and things were just always so hot that I would burn things. So last year we upgraded to the Everest camp stove, yep. and it has been a wonderful addition to our camping supplies. And my cooking continues to get better and better. And the Coleman stove was around 10,000 BTUs. The Everest jumps it up to 20,000. The simmer control was the biggest thing. It wasn't really BTUs that drove us to get the uh, upgrade. It was a simmer control Definitely. by far. After 20 plus years with the Coleman, they're so trusty and reliable. They work great. Number, number eight. eight. So number eight, I'm a light guy. Everybody knows <laughs> if you watch my channel. I don't know, what screen am I looking at here? Uh, <laughs> 
The Claymore light is absolutely phenomenal light. I absolutely love it. As a creator uh, with YouTube, I love it because it has two tones of color. It has a warm white and a bright white. But as a camper, I love the difference between the warm white and, and bright white. If you're doing task-oriented things, you can turn the bright white on and it's really good to flood an area. But if you want ambiance, you can turn it to the yellow light and it gives that softer white look. Both sets of LEDs in the same box has a 10,000 lumen battery pack built in. So in an emergency situation, I can charge my phone. It charges by micro USB, so it's an easy cable to recharge it. And I think I've gone on four trips and haven't charged it yet using it on every trip. The 10,000 milliamp battery pack inside is amazing. The battery runtime is phenomenal. It can be mounted on a tripod, has a great tripod design with a, a quarter inch um, uh, bolt at the bottom so you can screw it in just like your, your photo equipment, your cameras. And then you also have a little hook that can screw into there. So you can hook it onto your hiker. And what I ended up doing is I put a round, um, it's an accessory car magnet on the back. I stole that idea from another YouTuber and it just glues on with a little 3M. Uh, adhesive and that magnet then will allow me to just stick it to the side of my car, a truck, um, to the side of the hiker roof bars and gives me great area lighting really quickly. It's my go-to light because it is 100% waterproof and doesn't have any issues with weather. If I leave it out on the side of the trailer, we leave, come back, it rained, it's not a big deal. So, All right, number nine. nine. So this is probably my favorite thing of them all, is the Dometic fridge. No more ice. Yes. Ugh, so we don't have to worry about things floating in the refrigerator cooler. It is always cold. It has no ice. I can have one section that's drinks, I have one section of kind of the meats and extras, and there's a shell or a shelf that has like my eggs and cheeses and things along that line. Um, we got the 65 model i think it is and we had enough room for all the food we needed for that 10-day trip um, and it, you're able to charge it by ac dc and solar so it gives you many different options so while you're traveling you can have it hooked up to your vehicle to charge during the day and then it has a strong enough battery to um oh we had it hooked up to the jackery and we we're able to go overnight easily when it's connected to the jackery and the thing i like about it the most in the middle of the night, you can get a drink and there's an LED light in it. Ooh. <laughs> More about the lights. Light lights up the inside so you can see what you're getting to in the, at nighttime. Okay. Okay. Number, Number 10. 10. Number 10, Jackery. If you follow my channel at all, I love the Jackery product line. Um, I started out with a smaller 500 mm -hmm. and I've since moved up to the 1000. 1000 is a great model. It's got everything you need for DC. Um, the main thing I use my Jacker 1000 for is taking care of my fridge. I can leave the fridge in the tow vehicle. I can take it like we did today. We went on a daytime adventure. The fridge comes with us. We got all our lunch stuff in there, our cold drinks, everything with us. And the Jackery keeps it charged up, no problem. Now while I'm driving around, I'm also topping off the Jackery and the Jackery's topping, or uh, maintaining my fridge so i have no issues with battery that is my second battery i don't have to have a second battery in my trailer i don't have to have a second battery in my truck it's right there it's portable i get a storm at night i can bring it in the house and i can use it for storm situation maintain a, a small refrigerator or take care of lighting inside if we had a, a storm or a tornado or something come through so it's a very versatile tool mm -hmm. absolutely love it that is our top 10. And like we said before, all these items, you can be found at our Amazon affiliate store. Um, we'll have the link in the description below. If you could use those, that'd be great. It helps support our channel so we can continue giving you great content like this. Guys, I'm just totally overwhelmed how awesome the channel has exploded this year. Mm -hmm. All the new followers, uh, whether you're a camper, a hiker trailer owner, or just like following our content in general, we I have to say from the bottom of our hearts, thank you very much. We really appreciate it. Um, it helps us continue to build new content and new things. We love it. So like we say at the end of every video, get out and do some camping. Oh, uh, we gotta like, share, and subscribe oh, first. Oh, we gotta do that, yes. So we say like, share, share and subscribe, and, and get, get out, out and, and do, do some, some camping. camping.
Bye. Bye. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.